Hello YouTube. This is going to be a quick showcase of my dual switch door controller setup in which two switches are able to open and close a set of doors. The idea behind this setup is that you would place one switch in your innermost core of your setup of your uh, base sorry and one in the exit so that when you get up when you log on you can open all the doors not having not having to open each one of them individually and close all of them from the exit with when you place a switch there this eliminates the you know annoying task that everyone has or annoying task that everyone has to do when they are ex entering and exiting their base of having to open and close each garage door individually it saves a little bit of time but i guess that time is lost when you're setting up a setup to be honest it's not that difficult to set up especially now that the door controllers have pass-throughs. Alright, so the only warning about this setup is that switches obviously are a bit of a issue when it comes to people raiding you. Smart switches, luckily, are only able to be used by people who have TC access. But if someone destroys your TC, they're, go they're going to be able to have access to these switches. I'm not sure if a place with no building priv is able to use this door or this uh, TC. Sorry, these switches. I'm gonna test it right now. All right, I have no building priv there. Remove this. If that's the case, then that is a bit of a liability. So you might want to take that into account when you decide to make this setup. The uh, the purpose of this setup is purely for convenient convenience. If I have not already made that apparent. And it is a little bit of a hassle because it does take some power, especially if you have a lot of doors. It starts to add up. The amount of power that this setup requires really only depends on how many doors you decide to add. Each door controller takes about one power, so you have to slowly add up. And really, you need two power each because you need to um, be able to turn it on from two separate switches, or have the amount of power, like the input power for each door controller, from two separate switches. So it's a two per two per one door controller essentially. The initial power you need for two doors is about 10 to 12, and you do this by plugging in your battery into your electrical branch to po um, allocate power for the whole entire setup. Sorry, the server's about to restart, and I kind of panic because I'm not going to log back on after the server restarts. This is just purely to allocate power for your setup. The rest of the power can go to whatever else you need, like turrets or such. From here, it's important, in my opinion, that for power um, for efficiency sake they use two separate branches and not use one to split into two but really it doesn't matter you can use one switch and use a branch out you just need to have half the power allocated to each one this allows you to continue your power sourcing from this this branch I guess so you would put half the power into the first switch or first branch and half the power into the second branch each branch would link into one switch like such, and both the switches output would be linked back into a Zor switch. A Zor switch looks like this right here. Make sure you use the Zor switch or it will definitely will not work. Um, from there, you power out into your first door controller. And because pass-throughs were added in through door controllers, it's a lot easier now. You just plug the pass-through into the next power in. And as long as you have enough power, um, allocated for all your garage doors. This the setup should work. If you run into any issues where uh, doors were not are not opening for any reason, increase the amount of power incrementally until you get it to work, and then lower it by one by each or by one each until you find the most efficient amount of power needed to power your door setup. All right. Uh, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please leave a comment. I will try to get to it. I tried to make this quicker because I didn't feel like explaining everything. There are definitely some nuances to this setup that must be explained. Thank you.